All right, guys, it looks like almost everything's in place for our trip tomorrow. Hooray! I can't wait to get out of this place for a little bit. Seriously, a vacation is just what we needed. What else do we have to do before we leave? Well, there's just one problem. No one ever got a house sitter. Why do we even need someone to house sit while we're gone? I guess we technically don't, but I just feel like someone should look after the place while we're away and keep it in shape, you know? Plus, we need someone on constant lookout of my fashion collection. I have some extremely rare collectibles in my closet that need 24-7 security. And I need someone to take care of my pet frog. When did you get a pet frog? Well, technically, I'm just holding it temporarily for my buddy Gil. His insect and amphibian collection got a little offhand, so I'm watching one of his frogs until he can clear out some space for it in one of his terrariums. Ew! You're telling me I've been living with a frog unknowingly? Yuck, I think I need a shower. Well, long story short, we need a house sitter after all. How are we supposed to find a house sitter this last minute? We'd have to find someone we know who doesn't have a job or virtually any other responsibilities, and who'd be willing to help us for little to no pay. Oh no. All right, Holt, listen up. We're only asking you to house it because you're our last option. This does not mean you get to let loose and live it up in our house, got it? Clear as crystal. Why do you need a house sitter anyway? We're going out of town for the week. You're traveling right now? Raven, we're in a parallelogram. Uh, you mean a pandemic? It's not like that. We're literally just doing a road trip and booking a hotel downtown for a few days. Anyway, somehow you're the only person we could find this last minute to watch over the house, so you'd better do a good job. You're already on thin ice after the time you failed miserably at being our roommate. You don't have to worry, Abby. I've totally matured since then. We'll see. That means no parties! You got it! And don't you dare lay a finger on any of my gluchi! All right, then we're heading out. Bye, Holt! See you guys! No parties! Yo, Deuce! You'll never believe where I am right now. You gotta get over here, man. So you're watching the house for the ghouls for this entire week? Yup. Sick, right? Um, yeah. This is a crazy upgrade from your apartment. I know it's only for the week, but man am I gonna live it up while I can. Your toad's free to crash with me while I'm here, too. The ghouls didn't say anything about not having guests. Oh yeah, thanks, homie. This place is so dope. You don't even know, bro. Their kitchen is stacked. You wouldn't believe all the food they've gotten there. Yo, I haven't had a real meal in weeks. Actually, I've pretty much been surviving on just pizza since I started working at that pizza place. And they have working AC. No way, bro. Yup, we're gonna be living in the lap of luxury this week, homie. Ah, <sighs> I can't wait for a week of relaxation. It's so nice to be able to get away for a while, even if we can't really do much. I am not happy about having to spend the week in such close quarters with you hobos, but I guess I can make do. Although this is not the luxurious vacay I would have hoped to take. I would have much preferred the Bahamas, but whatever. Well, I've made a detailed itinerary full of fun activities to keep us busy. I researched all of the best restaurants, shops, and scenery around the area. Ugh, there goes Frankie being an overachiever again. As long as there's a bar somewhere on that itinerary, I'll be happy. All right, everybody, let's unpack quickly and head out. I scheduled us for a walking tour of the city in an hour. Hey, I wonder what Holt's doing in our house right now. I can't believe all the stuff this house has, man. This shower in the upstairs bathroom actually works. Yo, for reals? Yup, we might actually be able to shower again. No way! Dang, it's been months since I've had a shower. Same, broski. I, I'm off to explore everyone's rooms upstairs. I just know these people have some bougie stuff up there. Peace! Mmm, -mm, a brother is eating good today. This stuff is gourmet, man. For reals, this shredded cheese smacks. All right, let's see what they've got on TV here. Yo, ho, they have a Netflix subscription. Sweet, I can finally sign out of my ex's account now. Oh yeah, time to binge some Gossip Girl. Yo, Holt, can you pop me some popcorn? Wow, Heath has some serious designer in there. Deuce, get over here! Sick, a glushy belt. Hand it over. Oh yeah, now this is a dope fit. Oh, we have totally gotta have a fashion show right now. Oh yeah!
is so trippy, man. Yo, Holt, you gotta snap a few pics of me for the gram. This fit is straight fire. Totally, bro. Aight, strike a pose. Swag! Yep, this goes hard, Deuce. You've gotta post this. Aw, oh, yeah. Dude, you might think I'm crazy right now, but hear me out. We've got an entire house to ourselves, this place is loaded with snacks, and we're dripped out in some sick designer clothes. We'd be totally stupid not to throw a party right now. A party? Deuce, we're in a panini press! Oh, come on. This is a once-in-a-lifetime chance. Ugh, I know, bro, but Abby was totally serious about not throwing any parties. But just think about the epic rager we could throw. It would be the party of the century, man. Alright, you've convinced me. Call up everyone you know and tell them to be here in an hour. I'll grab the essentials and queue up my party mixtape. Aw, oh, yeah! Come on in, gang. The party starts now! Drinks are in the kitchen, everyone. Help yourselves. All right, peeps, here's the deal. We've got the entire house to ourselves tonight, so go absolutely crazy. I mean, no holding back. It's gonna be a total rager. Just, uh, don't post anything on social media. That includes Snap Stories, people. All right, let's go. Woo! Well, this is kind of boring, but I guess it's nice to be bored in somewhere other than my room. True that! Hey, I wonder what Holt's doing right now. I'd rather not know. I don't like the fact that he has unmonitored access to our entire house. Well, it's not exactly unmonitored. Huh? You seriously think I'd trust Holt enough to not put some sort of backup in place? I set up a nanny cam in the living room. That is genius. How did I not think of that? Well, come on, let's see what he's up to. Nah, not yet. I want to have some fun and mess with him first. I'm just gonna give him a call and check in real quick. We'll do some spying later. Hey, Holt. Yo, Abby. Uh, what's up? What are you doing, Holt? What's all of that noise? Oh, <laughs> I'm just watching some flicks. Flicks? Yeah, you know, Netflix. There's a really intense documentary on right now, bro. It's riveting. Okay, you're not having a party right now, are you? What? A party? No way! You better not be lying to me, Holt. No lies here. I'm just chilling. Good. Well, that was a close one. Alright, someone pour me another round of shots. And let's turn up the music, guys. I'm trying to get hearing damage after tonight. Uh, guys? Have anyone seen a small green frog? Why are you looking for a frog? Well, Jackson was looking over one of my pet frogs for me, so I went to check on him while I was here, and this cage is knocked over. Someone must have partied a little too hard and set him free. Yikes. Well, I can't help you with that. Bye. Oh, man. Guys, please keep an eye out for my frog. He's very shy around new people. Here, froggy, froggy. All right, I'm bored again. It's time to spy on Holt. Finally, I do not trust him. Me neither. There was a little too much background noise when I called him earlier, and since when does Holt watch documentaries? Let's just check our trusty nanny cam here. God dang it. You've got to be kidding me. Why do we keep giving him all of these chances? I seriously don't know. I'm disappointed, but not surprised. Well, what now? It looks like our vacation is being cut short. We have a party to bust. That's fine by me. Let's pack our bags and go get them. Honestly, getting to yell at Holt is more therapeutic than a vacation anyway. All right, people, hold it right there. Abby, what are you doing back already? Ugh, deuce. I should have known you'd be involved with this somehow. Now the real problem. Holt, what is wrong with you? Uh, I can explain. Dude, how many chances do we have to give to you? I don't know. To be honest, I was surprised you even let me back in your house at all anymore. Ugh, well we won't after this. How'd you find out? First of all, you're Holt. Second, look behind you. That's a nanny cam above the door frame. Dang it. Holt, Deuce, get out. Everybody else, the party is over. You all better beat it before the cops get called. Gil, what are you still doing here? My pet frog is missing! I can't leave without making sure he's safe! Well, that's too bad. Bye! Ugh, and of course now we're left with this giant mess. Great. One day Holt is gonna pay for this. Alright, let's call everyone else and tell them the vacation is over. They've gotta get down here and help us clean this up. So much for a relaxing getaway. Oh no! Look at this mess! Oh dear! 
Ugh, let's get upstairs and start cleaning so we can get this over with.